Hello everyone, Super Mario Poke here, and here I have a Wi-Fi battle. Now, before we get too into the battle, two things. One, um, tomorrow we will be starting the signups for the next tournament, so if you wanted to be in that, I'm letting you guys know now. Um, there are only 64 slots, so make sure you sign up before it is too late. Second thing is, I'm still currently editing it, but I am working on a Let's Play, and it actually takes a lot of editing to make it look good, so I hope you guys enjoy it. And I hope you guys support it. I will be it's a Volt White Let's Play, so I'll be starting that soon, probably Friday or Saturday. I'm um, just gonna pick a good time to start the uploads and it won't be too much of it. It'll be mainly still, you know, what I'm doing because it'll probably be the let's play only once or twice a week because it's a lot of work. Um a couple hours per video at least. Um so I hope you guys enjoy it. And I'm just letting you guys know that I will be doing that, so make sure to look out for that. Now, to the battle, Chris here is a freaking man. And he will be uploading again once he gets his mic fix or a new mic or his mic fix. I don't know if he started uploading already because he might have got one at Christmas. Um, I haven't checked. But if you were going to go check him out and be like, oh, he doesn't have any videos, he is planning to post soon. Just to let you guys know. Now, I'm just going to go to It's a Trap. As I can you know, trap this guy, I need to take out the steals as I'm using the Enter the Dragon team, which I've never really used before this battle. I just kind of wanted to use it, see how it did. He wanted to test an OU team, and it worked out. So here I am going to trap his fortress as I got to take out the steals for my dragons. Because my dragons appreciate that. They appreciate it. Now... I do get the boost a lot, and that helps because he has a heat ran that he's going to send in after this fortress goes down. And, I mean, I need to just do something. I I can't just, like, sit here, let his steals roam free, and then I lock myself into outrage. I have to take these pokes out to let myself outrage. As you guys know what Enter the Dragon is, it's, it's, it's a very good team, but, I mean, you know what it is. Uh, basically, it's designed for hacksters and men's to sweep all over everyone's face. And that's that's pretty powerful. I think it's powerful. Now, heat ran. It goes for the uh, uh the I forget what it's called. No, flame charge. There we go. Now I thought the rain was up because I was I just kind of misplay on my part. I still thought the, I thought the rain was up. I have not gone into Polytoad yet, so the rain is not up, which means I'm gonna go down, which is a bummer. But oh well. Um, yeah, unfortunately, I forgot the rain was up, or not up, and if it wasn't up, I may have even not, you know, maybe Flame Charge wouldn't even break my sub, so, unfortunately, I didn't get the rain up in time for that, but what can you do, right? Just gonna go for Scald, finish off the Heat Red, as I yawn, but the, uh, thing is, though, he has this, this Mac OS error message, and I'm just gonna Toxic. As that thing needs to be toxic. It's probably one of the Pokemon that in the game that you're just like, yeah, if I see it on a team, I'm gonna toxic it. And if it switches in on a Blissey and gets Trace Natural Cure, I'm gonna hate my life. Although one time I was battling, and I don't remember if I uploaded it or not, but I was using the Fling Toxic Orb Glyscore uh, with Knock or Fling Thief that thing, and I flung my Toxic Orb. And he switched into a Porygon 2. And then, um, traced my Poison Heal. You know, he has a Violite. And he, uh, yeah, he traced my Poison Heal, got toxic And then the next turn, he was faster because I was running a really slow one in Ice Beam. So then I had to deal with that. And that took some time. And that was annoying. And if that's happened to you, leave, like, if, leave a comment of something like that that's happened to you like it's hard to give a title to that kind of thing other than just like total troll moment where you're just getting trolled by Porygon or getting I don't know Pokemon just hating you just leave a comment about that you know tell me tell me your stories because that was definitely a story and that sucked that's got to be the hardest thing to take down Porygon 2 with the Violite that's in recovery it has recovery like Poison Heal that thing is bulky oh my gosh but i still won the match though i remember that i still won the match um and i'm not sure if i critted the porygon 2 or not because i had terrakion so i mean it wasn't that bad but it was definitely a pain now back you know off this semi-tangent to the battle where he sends back in his porygon um you know, i can't 
you know, I gotta wear this guy down because I know Outrage won't finish him off. Uh, and I Thunderwave predicting the switch. As I figured, he's, I don't know, I didn't think he would stay in. I forgot what he was predicting, but probably, you know, some trying to go to those dragons on a switch or something. But, wow, another yawn. But now I'm just going to go to Rotom Wash as he goes for the recover. And, yeah, this thing is very stally, very annoying. Uh, and it's definitely a problem as I don't have much to deal with it. But luckily, I did get the toxic off. I'm just going to go for paint split. I do get a little bit of damage um, done to him and also a little bit recovered to the point where I'm still sitting, you know, at 92. It's not too bad now because I get my lefties. And I believe, do I have leftovers as well? No, I don't. But I can finish him off with Volt Switch. And so there goes that error message. So the error message is taken care of. Um, they, you know, just sold the Mac. It sucks. Um, <laughs> but I go to the claw. And the claw is just going to go ahead and give me, you know, nice little stuff as he goes to his Red Bull. Who gives me wings. Well, apparently I fell, crashed, and died because Ferrothorn goes down. There's no way I'm getting up from that. Luckily, though, you know, Iron Barbs does a little, you know, consolation damage. I guess I don't know consolation damage what can you do I have the intimidate with tie fighter and he has stone edge he's actually running expert belt terrakion and that is the play of the match the expert belt terrakion taking out mens as now I'm just like there's nothing there's nothing terrakion wins so good game Chris make sure to check him out link will be below and yeah, so that's all of it for me. But remember, tomorrow will be the uh, the tournament starting, and then regular uploads as planned, and ho soon the LP will start. So other than that, I hope you do enjoy. I will see you guys later. Peace.